Global Network. Find them online, watch for the next event. Keep checking the website daily. Fight Sport Global Network. This event is an XCF production. Next up, the XCF Lightways are back in action. Introducing first, he comes to us from Fort Dodge, Iowa. Our freestyle fighter fighting for Midwest MMA Academy, standing five foot eight, 154 pounds, with the current mixed martial arts record of two and one. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Tom Aaron. Tom, to the top, Aaron's. To the top. Tough kid out of Fort Dodge, Iowa. Yeah. Wrestling background. Has that grown up Eddie Munster look about him. Looks all business. Back to that day, Pee Wee Herman. <laughs> what do you think? Where does a guy go like that? Where does he go? You know what? He's a talented guy, and he's well-spoken. He's got a good look to him. I mean, a guy like that, hey, this guy's the limit for you know, Really, to be honest with you, I mean, I think he looks great. That kid could definitely uh, go to the big shows uh, anytime. But obviously Ladies and we'll gentlemen, keep him here. his opponent, also in the lightweight division, now a UFC veteran. He comes to us from Waukee, Iowa. Also a freestyle artist with an emphasis in wrestling. Part of the Des Moines Mixed Martial Arts Academy. He stands foot eight, 155 pounds. His record, 13 wins versus five losses. You better stand back because the hurricane's coming. This is John the Hurricane Halverson. John Halverson, UFC vet. Had a lot, a lot of experience uh, in, in big shows. Tough guy, tough guy. Prefers to stand up and bang, but but is very good on the ground. Local boy from Waukee. Kind of a Slipknot, Freddy, what is that mask? Yeah, Jason. I, I'm guessing that's Jason or something. Really never watched those movies. Never, never got into those movies. No? No. Crowd favorite. Alverson really looks to be in the best shape of his life. I mean, he he looks good. He used to fight at 170 pounds, 55. Said it, this is the easiest time he's had to get down to 55. You can see he's real lean, cut up. Uh, just getting easier for him to stay down lower, and, and uh, that's great because uh, it does take it out of you to cut weight. How about Aaron's? What do you know about him? I know he's a tough kid. He's from Fort Dodge and, and uh, got a wrestling background, and those guys over there are very tough. And yeah, we've seen that tonight. This is round number 11, round number one. Both are in southpaw stances. Southpaws hate southpaws. <laughs> Aaron's very aggressive, charging Halverson. I'm sorry, Pat. Halverson doing a good job of stopping the takedown right now. Apologize, go ahead. I got like Aaron is fighting a UFC vet. That's got to kind of mess with your head a little bit, I'm thinking maybe. Eh. He's he's aggressive, look at him go. No, it doesn't look like he's respecting uh, no. <laughs> Halverson a whole lot at this point. <laughs> Not really. Digging in on the legs, got the, oh, oh nice. Oops. Good job getting out of the guillotine. Halverson went for it. Nice tip off the cage. There it is. Halverson so strong. Got the arm pin. I can't. Nope. Okay. Great scramble. Great scramble. Great exchange. Very good. Yes. Looking to set up the triangle. Halverson on his back. It looks like. Got to hold of Aaron's hands. Aaron's doing a good job controlling. Uh, 
You know, Hamilton was doing a good job when he first came to that guard of keeping him close. See yeah, it's, there, but. it's uh, definitely tactical stuff going on in there. I mean, people that aren't familiar with ground fighting have no idea how much is going on right now for position. There's a lot of tools being used and utilized and a lot of leverage going on. Halverson prying on the neck, and he has the underhook on the side to try and spin to an angle to pass the left leg. Aaron's doing a good job of shutting that angle down. Aaron tried really hard to it looks like, grimacing on top. Halverson very comfortable on the bottom, like I said before. Aaron's needs to sit up and, and throw some strikes. And, uh, the ref's probably going to stand him up here pretty soon if, if something doesn't change. Stuffing, that, stuffing the wrist, going for the triangle, but Aaron's, Aaron sees it coming. Nice elbow to Aaron's face. Go. Nice job by Aaron. Hold his position. Aaron cut open, face left eye. Aaron's gonna jump. <laughs> he thought about it, didn't he? <laughs> Good job, he went for it, got cross sides out of the deal. Nice job. Halverson very comfortable still. He never changes facial expression, does he, Halverson? You know, I can't tell. He has a man on top of his face at this point. I'm watching the monitors, and he just seems very confident. At the roll through, Aaron has his back. Trying to put the hooks in. Alverson defending it well. Nice roll. Nice adjustment. By, oh, my goodness. Aaron's, Aaron's a good athlete. Pretty impressive, isn't he? That's a tight headlock. Yes, that could is. turn into a choke. That's tough. That's a tough spot right there. He's got to roll him through. Halverson in a tough spot. That's a tough choke. Okay, Aaron kind of let up on that. Looks like Halverson might be cut. Can't tell. Aaron's very impressive. Very impressive. Halverson's got to get on his got to get on his left side and suck that left arm underneath his body to be able to turn into him. Anytime somebody has you in a headlock, you need to get on your side. That's in there tight. Pat, you were right. That's in there tight. They did a good job of reversing the position. He's got to keep that hand posted so he doesn't get rolled back over. Great position. Halverson, great position. I'm surprised Aaron's keeping a hold of that head. Yeah, that's what I was just going to say, Pat. At uh, some point, you have to bail and yeah, try and uh -oh, get position. Yeah, that, obviously. Side yeah. is turned. Yeah. Halverson on top. He stuck with the headlock too long, and, and uh, now, now he's got himself in trouble because of it. Now you've got a guy with some good experience on your back. This is not, not a good position. Not looking good for Tom Aaron. Oh, great shot. To, oh, Alverson raining blows on him right now. Alverson looking for the choke. He's got one arm in there. Nope. 20 seconds left. He's got to try and finish. I'll give Aaron credit. I'll give him credit. Oh, there's Aaron the choke. He lifted the head up. Not a good move. I don't, know, I don't know if he can even tap. The ref needs to pay attention here. His arms are trapped underneath him. Aaron's not moving. Aaron's is fine. Aaron does look fine. Premature call, maybe? Uh, yeah. 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 Aaron's tough kid. Great fight. Halverson got lucky, I think. Maybe. I don't think Aaron's was choking. No, he looks he, fine. He, he wasn't tapping. Oof. 